1250? 1250 for a little Caesar's order? Yeah. Yeah, Nick, we're gonna make some money today, bro. You got them tickets you gotta pay. I know you guys want to make some extra side money, but you're like, but Ryan, I don't know how to do that. What do I do? Well, let me ask you, are you over 18? Do you have a valid driver license? Do you have two working kidneys? If you answer yes to all of those things, I got the right business for you. Driving for DoorDash. Today, the homie Nick will share with us how much he made driving for DoorDash, and it's about $20 an hour, but you have to know when is the best time to do DoorDash, which we'll share in this video. And I just have to say, people are making great money delivering food. Man, I think I'm in the wrong business. So I've been doing a lot of driving apps, like Uber, Postmates, well, DoorDash, and you know what? I think you guys like those videos. So today we're gonna find out how much we make driving for DoorDash in a small town called Hanford. And let's see, maybe this app is for you. Let's go, and you know who we got to do it with? The homie. What's up? So Nick tells me he could make about 20 to $25 an hour driving for DoorDash. And I just looked at him and said, Nick, you don't got to lie to kick it, bro. But he says, you could make that much, but you have to wait for the right time. So Nick, where are we going, man? I'm going to Hanford. What do you do, what do you do? Whenever I'm about to start dashing, I just start the dash right when I get in my car. Last time I did this, I got an $8 order right away. You already got an order? Yeah. There you go, man, there you go. Like it told me, uh, Chipotle is where we're going and I'm getting paid $7. All right, all right, well, let's go, Chipotle. Man, I love Chipotle, Nick. I don't think I've had it yet. You never had Chipotle? I don't think so. We might have to go after this, Nick. I got you, fam. So we got the order right here. Let's go drop it off. What are we calling the customer, Nick? Uh, because he's in a gated community. And, yeah. and yeah. he doesn't have his address. How you going, Nick? How you go? Pretty good. All right. I'll pop up. There you go, seven dollars. Let me ask you this. Yeah. Why are you doing DoorDash? Um, you know, just to make a couple extra bucks to make some uh, ga gas money to uh, have more financial stability. So pretty much just to make some extra money. Yeah. And that's why I love the driving apps. Anybody could do it for any reason. For example, let's say you lost your job. Drive for Uber Eats until you find a new one. You have a job, but you want to make just some extra side money? Become a DoorDash driver. Or you just have a lot of things going on and you're looking for a reason to get out of the house just so you have some time to reflect on your life and the choices you made that got you to this point. Then Postmates is the app for you. That's pretty much it. Already another order? Already. Hell yeah, man. Another Chipotle one. <laughs> another Chipotle. Yep. And I'm starting to believe that getting tickets is just part of the whole driving app thing. Cause, uh, Nick, tell us about that ticket you got, Nick. So, I was doing DoorDash. I think it was on the like, third, fourth hour of doing it. Apparently, I was going a little fast. Uh -huh. uh, I was going 83 on the 65 and I saw the saw the magic man behind me and he who's, the, who's the magic man the cops a cop yeah CHP. Oh. Um, he told me that my car was on not up and I told him no it wasn't and then he told me yes it is and I told him no it wasn't so you started fighting with the cop yeah like, defending yourself so and then what happened did he let you go uh, after he threatened to uh, tow my car I was like, look, this is my first car, blah, 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 blah. I'm on my way to make some money real quick, uh, doing DoorDash. And he was like, okay, well, um, I'm going to give you two tickets for the non-op and for reckless driving. Oh. $700 ticket. Oh, man. I don't know about you guys, 
But me, I'm a sucker when it comes to the cops. I'm like, I'm sorry, officer. I'll do better next time. Uh, what would you guys do in that situation? All right, Nick, I'll see you in a bit, bro. All right. Good luck, Nick, good luck. Sure. Grace, what about the gas? There's this feature. Is that door down you do? Yeah. What was the feature? You can stack orders. So, now I go to Safe Mart. Oh, so now you get to pick another order before you deliver this one. Yep. So, Nick, you never got an order from uh, Safe Mart before? Nope, no Did... grocery stores yet. <laughs> so you don't know where you're going? Nope. Well, we're gonna find out today. Do you think it's ready or do you think you gotta shop for it? I think I have to shop. No! Another gated community, man. And you gotta get out, Nick? Yeah. Oh man, Nick, they're making you work. Yeah. Oh, look. Little oh, Caesar's order. Twelve fifty. Twelve fifty for Little Caesar's order. Yeah. I'll do that for free. For free, Nick. Let's get it, Nick. I'll do that for a slice of pizza. Yeah, Nick, we gotta make some money today, bro. You got them tickets. You gotta pay. Why do you think they're paying so much right now, though? They don't have enough people. They're stacking orders. Oh. So. And it's Sunday. It's uh. Football right now. Yeah. It's the Lord's Day, so nobody wants to come out. So when it gets really busy, the screen will turn red and tell you how much of a bonus you'll get. It tells you right there the hot spot. Yep. And it's gonna pay you an extra dollar. Yep. What's the most you've ever seen it? Uh four dollars oh. on Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving Day. But another way DoorDash lets you know it's busy is by sending you text messages but just know they'll message you at random times one time I got a message at 2 a.m. and it was DoorDash and he said hey you up and my girl was stripping DoorDash over here trying to break relationships snakes a ten dollar order bro mm -hmm. we're killing it over here Before I tell you how much he made driving for DoorDash in just two hours. If you like these ride along videos, press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss my next entrepreneur video teaching you different ways of making money. And thank you, Nick, for the free Nanai knowledge. And in return, I took him to Chipotle so he could try it for the very first time. And he said it was all right. All day was 47.56. Hey man, almost 50 bucks? Yeah. For just about two and a half hours of work? Yep, so it's about $25 an hour. Not bad at all, man. 